part of the trail is my favorite part of the trail because I've seen two snakes here. Oh my god, is that snake skin? That literally looks so creepy. Oh my god, that's a snake. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So if you guys don't know that I'm a wildlife photographer and I love taking pictures and videos of wildlife, nature and birds all around me. I'm in literally my favorite place on earth. I'm surrounded by nature and I just love this place so much and I wanted to make a video to show you guys our experience of bird watching. I'm gonna take you guys on this trail with me and I hope you guys like this video. I've seen so many different types of birds here. Here are a few of the pictures that I've taken of the birds that I've seen here. And I've also seen so many butterflies and taken so many different pictures. I see love walking here because this whole place is so 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 beautiful. We're surrounded by nature on all sides and I just love how mossy the whole road is and it's like I'm in the middle of like literally the wild. I just love that. Oh my god, this moth looks so cute sleeping on that leaf. And this butterfly looks so pretty. We continued walking and then saw this really cute squirrel crossing the road. Squirrels are one of the most cute mammals ever. I've seen so many different types of birds here. Here are a few of the pictures of the birds that I've seen. I've seen a tailor bird, I've seen oriental magpie robins, I've seen even insects like the cricket and spiders and I've seen reptiles like this lizard and it's honestly really really cool how many different types of creatures this park has. And I love looking out for the small creatures like this monarch butterfly because I just love the way that this monarch butterfly is drinking nectar from the flower. This part of the trail is my favorite part of the trail because I've seen two snakes here previously. I've seen a wine snake somewhere here and I've seen another snake species that I don't really know what it was. This park has so many different types of insects, snakes, birds and everything beautiful. I saw this cute little caterpillar walking and it really makes you think about how everything is a part of the food chain and everything really does matter. Even this tiny little caterpillar that's just crawling on a leaf is really important in the food chain. I just want you guys to listen to nature for a few seconds. It's so peaceful, so serene and the sounds of all the birds chirping is so amazing. We saw this really really creepy centipede. I don't think I've ever seen a centipede that looks like this. And there were so many mushrooms you guys. Um, the park was literally filled with different types of mushrooms everywhere and they looked so 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 different. And then we continued walking because we wanted to try to find more birds. We saw jungle mina. Jungle minas crawl on the forest floor trying to find insects to eat and they're really really beautiful birds. But then while walking we saw the weirdest thing ever. We saw a snake skin that was hanging from the branches of a plant and if you guys don't know snakes shed their skin every year and it literally looks so creepy but that's the skin that has been shed by a snake and it literally looks so weird. And this video that I'm showing you guys is not of this day that we were filming. I just wanted to show you guys the snake that I had once seen in that park. It's a red sand boa and it's one of the rarest snakes ever. And the reason it's so rare is because it literally lives underground most of its life and only comes out of the burrows that it lives in during mating season or during the monsoons. And we were so lucky that we got to see it out and about in nature while... It was such a beautiful snake, you guys. And then we continued our trail trying to find any more animals that we could find and we stopped at this beautiful place to take some pictures of butterflies since it was so peaceful and beautiful. Even the moths in this park look so beautiful and the butterflies are already so amazing. And then we continued walking because we had seen a lot of birds but we hadn't seen any aquatic birds like the heron or the egret and then we finally spotted a black crowned night heron. The trail was literally so beautiful, I can't believe I saw so many insects and birds and I hope you guys like this video too and if you guys want more videos where I go for trails and where I go exploring uh, looking for wildlife and birds then subscribe to my channel because I'm going to be making a lot of videos and I also upload shots every other day of my wildlife and birds photography so if you guys like my channel then hit the like button below comment down below what videos you guys want me to make next relating to wildlife or nature and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next one bye guys